string concatenation is one of the important concepts. In our today's session, we are going to write a program that will concatenate two strings. By the way, what is string concatenation? In simple terms, it is nothing but joining the strings. Hi, this is Sahana. Welcome to my channel. Just pick and learn. If you ask me what are the requirements to write this application, then I would say it's better to have Visual Studio installed in your system. I have Visual Studio 2022 installed in my system, so I'll go for it. Then the application type that I'm going to create is console application. If you want to know more about console application, like what it is, how to create it and how to use it, then I have a dedicated video on my channel. I'll keep the link in the description box. Later you can have a look. Open the Visual Studio, click on create new project. Then choose the console application template type. Click on next. Then give some meaningful name to your project. After giving the name, click on next. Then Choose the .NET framework. Here you have different frameworks. I'm choosing .NET Core 3.1. Click on Create. Now we have created the console application. Our first step is to take the input from the user. We will remove this line. We are taking the input from the user. We are printing the message on the screen saying enter the first string. Then we are taking help of read line method. This method will read the string from the console window and we are storing that in a variable str1. Then same way again we are asking the user enter the second string and we are storing that in a variable str2. So our input is ready. Now we have the input. Our next step is to concatenate the strings. We are going to concatenate with the help of concat method from the string class. I'll go to the definition. Look at the definition. This method takes two parameters, both are string. And if you look at the summary of this method, this method concatenates two specified instances of string. Hmm. If, you, uh, if you look at the statement, we are passing both the str1 and str2. These are the variables that we declared and we are storing the user input in these two variables. And we are passing the, and we are passing these two variables to concat method. And this method will prepare the concatenated string. And the return type of this method is string. That is the concatenated string. And we are storing that concatenated string in this variable. Our final step is to print the output on the screen. How are we going to do that? Very simple. Again, call the right line method and just pass the string three variable. This will print the uh, this will print our concatenated string on the console window. This is very simple program, but my main intention is to make you understand how the concatenation works. And don't worry, we will come up with the complicated examples. Let's get better with our basics. Now. I'll run the program. We are okay. We are given with the message. Enter the first string. I'll say C sharp. Enter the second string. I'll say tutorial, and our output is ready. Your concatenated string is C sharp tutorial. We are not getting any space in between C sharp and tutorial because we haven't given any space. Just combine the strings as it is. It will not do any type of formatting. If we have to do any formatting, then we have to write it in our code. Then it will give us the formatted string. This is our very simple program, which will concatenate two strings. Summary, step one, print the message on the screen and read the input, whatever the user has entered. Step two, Combine the strings by calling the concat method from the string class. Step 3. Simply print the concatenated string with the help of write line method. I hope the session was useful. I'll come up with lots and lots of programs to help you to get better at your programming skills. And do subscribe to my channel for more such videos. Thanks again.